she did a fantastic, I mean a fantastic job. You had Claudia from the Hollywood show. She did good. that he's doing called Dunk It, I think it's called. So I'm going to see that. And Friday, I will be downtown, volunteer with TLC, with one of the um, families that's on TLC. We're gonna feed the homeless people, so yeah. I had a good time. The seats was okay. It wasn't floor seating, but I had some pretty good seating. So yeah. Just waiting on this traffic to die down so we can go ahead and leave. Look at my hair. Let me show my hair. So. Okay, so I'm gonna try to make it to the car again this time. It was so many people last time, and the traffic had not cleared up. So the weather turned out to be pretty good. The first two days of the show, it rained tremendously. It, they had a lot, a lot of rain. So, today was the last. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. So, um, I was just complimenting what I had for him. Thank you. Girl, but y'all already know these shoes killing my feet, okay? And this unit I have on, with the help of Lady, she helped me make this wig because I was really getting frustrated with it okay with this closure which this is the hair that I purchased two years ago y'all know how I am when it comes to completing something okay yeah two years ago I bought this hair and I decided to highlight the hair and um yeah got my little baby all back up in the crack y'all trying to wait till some of this traffic clear out as soon as I get in the car, I'm gonna take these shoes off. But when I see my, my fingers hurting, okay. Oh my goodness. But it's amazing the great things that he's doing for the city of Atlanta and just people all over the world. It's really, really amazing. People can say what they want to, but this man is doing some great things, some really great things. And he's truly a blessing to a lot of people. So I'm just waiting, me and my baby, okay, because I just got her back. She had flatline y'all for two months, okay? She flatlined on me for two damn months. Resuscitated, I brought her back to life. And then after I brought her back to life, I'm gonna tell you something. Took it the other day to get a flat tire. Well, I didn't have a flat tire, I had a nail in my tire. And also, I wanted to get the tires rotated. So the guy gonna tell me, I get up in there, and he said, well man, what you come in here for? So I told him what I came for, this, that, the other. So he was like, well, let's go outside and take a look. I said, no, I'm not going back outside. You take your ass back outside and take a look, because I just told you what's wrong with the, car, with the car, okay? So he went back outside. He wanted me to come back outside, so he tried to tell me some time, but y'all know that didn't work, okay. So he went outside, came back in. It was 20 people inside there. So I think, okay, I had an appointment at one o'clock, didn't make it at the one o'clock, I shit. 
Next thing I know, I told him I had an appointment at 4 o'clock. So then he talked about the thrills. So I said, man, let me tell you something. This damn car on Flatline was brought back to life after two months and it's still on life support. I don't know if it's going to plunk out because I still need to get the eval and whatever fits on the car, right? So I don't know what the hell's going on. But, uh, yeah. The moral of the story is, I don't damn know. I just had to kill some time to all this traffic die down so I can get the hell on. So I hope you did enjoy my time and the time we share together. Until next time. Y'all already know I'm coming back on when I'll be back. Until next time, be blessed by y'all. Look at that, look at that, girl. You did that. Look at that, look at that. I hope my boobies ain't out. I hope my boobies not out. Look at them shoes. Look at that. Look at Jessica. Look at Jessica. Look. Do y'all see Jessica down there? Yes, girl. All right, y'all. Bye, y'all.